hey lovelies welcome back to my channel my name is mamus ate a makeup artist based in wari delta state nigeria today's video is taking you through martial skin best foundation best processes and best techniques for martial skin and here is my beautiful client and you know when you're making up a martial skin from 40 50 years and above you have to be gentle because their skin is soft and tender i started off by you're doing a proper skin prep by cleansing her face and then toning her skin a little bit and then i went in with my serum and i'm using a brush and then i'll have to apply that gently and then i'll wait for it to dry off before moving to the next step and the next step i use the smash boss primer please i'm sorry i will not be showing you all the products i use because you know for wedding wedding morning is always a rush so i used the smash boss primer and then i also applied a setting powder as another base of primer next is color corrector i'm using a concealer from the mac cosmetics um, color corrector palette i just applied that on under her eyes aside the fact that she have eye bag she also have red circles yeah on her eyes so i'm just going to color correct that gently and then i'm using a very soft blending brush to just tap that gently her skin is very soft and for my short skin you know they have lots of wrinkles is it wrinkles or wrinkles anyhow but you understand under their eyes and then i went in with my setting spray this setting spray is from the soap pro and then i'm just blending that you can see how the concealer just uplift her eyes and covered that redness and then i'm going in with a foundation not a i'm going in with three different foundation mixed together which brings us to the main topic of this video and the main um one of the best tips for my short skin right here for foundation application i miss the nas share glow foundation this is very important for my short skin because it's lightweight and it's beautiful you can see that looking at this makeup process there is no difference between the mac concealer that i applied earlier on and the foundation shade and then i have to color correct for someone that have a reddish undertone i actually missed three foundations i missed the nas share glow and Lore and Lacombe foundation. These three foundations are always my go-to for my short skin because they are lightweight. They are not heavy on the skin. They are beautiful. You see how I started the application using a brush and then I went in using a beauty blender to further blend the entire face to avoid any fine lines. This is very important, especially for those of us that are used to blending with brush. When you are done, try to also use a beauty blender to just blend the entire process. And then when I'm done with this, I'll be going into contour. And for contour, I did not do a dark contour. I use a warm shade of the black upper um, foundation. Yeah, that's what I'm using. So I just did a very light contour. You can see it's warm on her skin and then i went in with my concealer from the kevin Oakwan in the shade oh it's yep so i'm just going through the process of highlight and contour and mama is not just mama this mama is a delicious mama hmm. so i see the irish they look me so they say you better do this thing well because today i'm gonna slay you know so you can see how i'm gradually just building up mama's facial structure you know old age is something that all of us will definitely get to if i were praying to get to the old age so what i'm just doing is basically just using my brush to mold the face because i'm just thinking of the right words to use right now and it's not coming through it's not my fault at times english had uh -huh. so from that under the jaw the joy line hmm? you see the area where i just put all the concealer and from under that joy line see i'm gradually just tapping the brush gently one thing you should know is that my short skin are usually very soft very tender yeah and you just need to be careful so i'm just trying to build a chic bone and then i move on to the nose to further you know blend the concealer in the nose gently 
because we need to just check out how mama's cheekbone is properly highlighted and then when i was done using the brush i went in with a beauty blender to blend and then i went in with a powder from the charlotte tuberi the face powder compact powder so i'm just blending a particular shade on the areas where i already highlighted you see how i go in section by section carefully because you know they have fine lines and sometimes they have wrinkles so you just gradually build your powder yeah mama had to admire her face and she loved it in fact this mama know it is she wants to oh, hmm. when your mama knows what she wants hmm, that's this beautiful client of mine and it was really a beautiful section with her okay so for contour i used the uh, max skin finishing powder in the shade dark deep and then for um, highlight i used the laramencia setting powder in the shade lucent so at this point mama friend was around and they were having their own ladies gists you know uh, you know her son is getting married so she gonna slay she gonna slay Okay, so I'm just blending the nose, trying to further define the nose. Can you see the difference? Like mama's before and mama's process right now. Her structures, her facial structures are all coming out. And then I just use a brow timer to place on the eyebrows. I'll leave the brow timer there to dry. And then I'll go in with my eyeshadow primer, which is the Ben 9. I had to put my hands there, you know, see mama's. And everywhere on the slack you know so i need to put my hand for there for support system to take spread the ss skin where did they go up so that my brush go fit enter the place where i want to make it enter and for mamas when you do they put the eyeshadow make sure the brush is very soft okay a very soft brush and then don't just start blending make sure you first of all pat the product place the product on the eyes before you start blending and then i took a razor blade and I'm just trying to uplift mama's eyes. Immediately I took off the razor blade, check out the difference. So I do this to make sure that the eyes are uplifted, you know. They are mamas now. Makeup is to add to one's beauty and not to make them look uglier, okay? So I'm just trying to build the eyes. See the outer corner of the eyelid on the right hand side. You can see how it's fine, okay? And then I, the brush was not doing enough justice for me at big. I just begin to use my finger because my fingers, my hands are usually my best brush ever. You know, there's no failure with them. So I'm just using my hands. See, and I face knees, so I get to buy the knees come out because mama's eyes are small. You know, those long knees cannot go into those eyes. And when I was done, I used a setting powder to just sweep off and um, fall out of eyeshadows from the eyeshadow application and then i went in with my beauty by jumps eyeliner and then i'm going in with my mascara you can see the process i used and mama really loved it she really loved it like uh, she will look at her phone she'll ask her friend she loved the way she looked and i love the way she looked check out those those cheekbone like everything smash and then another thing i did was for mamas because they don't want to sit for long this makeup was a really fast one so what i did was i finished the eyeshadow first before going into the brows and for brows of course you know you already know what i use more on this channel i use my ega and esther brow gel in the shade i think toffee yes because they have three different shades they have the nuban the ebony and toffee so i use the toffee as my brow gel and then i went in with a concealer to just for the um uplift a brow bone you know makeup uh, you are just trying to uplift all the structures on the face okay okay and then when i was done i just pat that gently as for the brush i use on the brows is the mirac mirac cosmetics brush that's what i use man since this brush came it has been my favorite too and it's been two years now but yes two years or a year but maybe let me just say a year 
it's been one of my favorite angle brush because it's very easy to work with you know so i'm just blending 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 blend 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 those ash line out of the brows okay and you can see mama is still admiring as you see hmm. this makeup section was a very sweet one interesting one for me i actually had phone no true i had free phone and funny how on this day i was already tired because i had like seven clients to make up on this particular day anyway if you are seeing this video now this video was actually shot in december which is the peak for all makeup artists you know but because i already schedule some of my videos on youtube you will be seeing this video sometime in january or february i think so january or february yes yes because i already scheduled some of my posts okay but why am i telling you this i'm just telling you that i've been standing for hours on this day i stood like i practically stood for 12 hours making up different persons driving to different location and you know what god is so faithful that on this day all the clients I did their makeup was so happy with their makeup and some even gave an extra tip. See, eh? God is too faithful. God is just too faithful. And that's another thing eh? I've come to realize in business that every day before you leave your house, eh? no matter how you think you are good in your career, make sure you seek the face of God. Make sure you invite the Holy Spirit into whatever you are doing because sometimes eh, you will plan to do a very beautiful makeup but by the time you start the thing go the go where you know send a make it go and you know go just know why see how beautiful mama is looking like can you remember can you still remember mama's before can you i bet you cannot forget mama is looking pink see babe now she loved it like she took her phone she smiled oh baby girl she's like when i will enter the hall eh, they will know i am the groom's mother ah ah mama admire is safe i beg i like to get swag like this for my old issue as in i wanted to add lip gloss mama said no if you add lip gloss by the time i drink anything or sip anything oh yeah the lip will clean this makeup got to be for the old day my daughter, I don't want lip gloss. I want mats. My dear Daza, I first of all carry powder to place on top of the mat so that it will be matte. Well, because sometimes when lip stain are over dry, they start cracking and they start breaking. So that's another tip I do. Okay, mm -hmm. now you know. And then I went in with my eyeliner pencil from the Mirac Cosmetics, and then I'm going in with my glue, Fenty Beauty glue check out mama nose now nah. hey forget forget it see mama now nah. just the play they play <laughs> you guys play you go tired eh mama fairy sit down for there just they admire see she cool just they admire mama say hmm. please uh, this person this makeup artist is going to do my makeup my dear i was not done though. because mama's eyes are small I needed to apply glue on the eye tear dots to make it pop very well. Went in with my setting spray from the Soul Pro to lock all of that product in and to set properly. And then Mama have to use a mini fan to just dry that. Check out cheekbones, check out the structures of her face. And then the blouse she was wearing, the neck was a bit open. So her cheekbone was, her collarbone was showing. So I had to glue that up. Ha! When mama look at it, see the smile. <laughs> I say, thank you. Ah! And then I went in again to lock everything with this sweat block. This one is from FBH, man. This product is another killer. And then you need to dry it again. This sweat block. <clears throat> if you don't have it, go and sew into it. Go and buy it. This thing, they do magic. You know, and then when I was done with this, I, I also allowed this to dry. Check out all the structures of her face showing. Makeup is actually supposed to make you look more beautiful. Makeup is something that enhances one's facial structure, okay? 
and you can see all the structures showing it big and more mama loved the makeup and see when my clients love their makeup it gives me a joy a certain type of joy i can't even explain and then it was time for the gilly stylist to do his own thing and his name is beauty palette as it was time the gilly immediately mama turned i just check out that sharp chic bone forget may see mama now guys if you enjoy watching this video please do want to like share comment subscribe to this channel it is free you're not paying for it please it's a new year happy new year once again i beg subscribe not to go do your hand not to go do your finger tell your friends about mama sati and i hope you enjoyed everything about this video i will see you soon in my next video until then stay blessed be happy smile often and bye guys